the brother has an ask a question um, making dua in eastern countries a rasul okay to file for sake of profit so allah can uh, listen to the dua making a type of uh, the wife for the sake of uh, that person for the sake of all the uh, for the sake of that buzurg for the sake of that messenger for the sake of the prophet this is all like a kufr and also this is a shirk because uh, because for an example uh, when a Muslim has to swear, he has to only swear, uh, I swear to Allah, I, I take an oath, uh, Allah. So, uh, making a dua for the sake of someone, that's like, uh, we are giving an importance to someone more than Allah. So, for an example, uh, why this is being kufr? because we are expecting that Allah will not listen to our dua so for the sake of Prophet Sallallahu Allah will listen to our dua so this is a uh, kufr not expecting the mercy of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and asking for the sake of Rasulullah Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam so why this is a shirk because we asking uh, Allah that uh, that he is someone who is going to listen to us and Allah will not listen to us so this falls into the kufr and the shirk so we are comparing like we are trying to uh, because there's a beautiful hadith where the Prophet Sallallahu said <coughs> uh, he told the Sahaba Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam do not praise me like the Christians praise Isa Alayhi so so the, so uh, in another hadith one of the Sahaba said, he was asking a question like when the Sahaba said, uh, only you know, or Allah knows. So, and the Prophet ﷺ got really upset with that and uh, he told the Sahaba, just say only, only Allah knows. Wallahu alam, only Allah knows best. I do not know. So, putting uh, Allah and the Prophet ﷺ, this is a shirk. So, we, when we ever we have to ask dua, so the way we have to ask dua is we have to ask directly to Allah and we have to ask from Him by praising Him by His names. Oh, Ya Allah, You are Rahim. Oh, Ya Allah, You are Kareem. Ya Rahman, Ya Rahim, Ya Malik al Quddus, Al Salam, Al Mumin, Al Muhammad, Al Aziz, Al Jabbar, Al Matkabir, Al Khalik, Al Bari, Al Masawir, Al Ghafar. Al Kahar, Al Wahab, Al Razak, Al Fatah, Al Alim, Al Kabid, Al Basit, Al Khafid, Al Rafi, Al Mu'iz, Al Mu'zil, Al Mu'zil, Al Sami, Al Basir, Al Hakam, Al Adal, Al Latif, Al Khabir, Al Halim, Al Azim, Al Ahur, Al Shakur, Al Ali, Al Kabir, Al Hafiz, Al Makid, Al Hasib, Al Jalil, Al Karim, Al Rakib, Al Majib. Al Wazi Al Hakim Al Badud Al Majid Al Baath Al Shahid Al Haq Al Wakil Al Khabi Al Matin Al Wali Al Hamid Al Muhsi Al Mubdi Al Muid Al Muhi Al Mumid Al Hay Al Qayyum Al Wajid Al Majid Al Wahid Al Ahad Al Samad Al Qadir Al Maktadir Al Maqdam Mu'khar Al Awwal Al Aakhir Al Zahir Al Batin Waliha Mutaal Al Bar Al Tawab Al Muntakim Afu Al Raouf Al Malik Al Mulk Al Jilal Al Kuram Al Maksud Al Jamia Ghani Al Maghni Al Maniha نور النافع نور الهادي بديء الباكي الوارث الرشيد الصبور جل جلاله ذلكم الله ربكم الحق يا الله you are the one you are the only doer this is only you who can solve my problem you are you only shafi ya allah it is you only who can listen to me you created the sun you created the moon you created the earth you created everything alone you are the doer i will ask i will repent from my sin ya allah forgive me forgive me my sins ya allah forgive my sins please forgive my sins and please forgive me my sins ya allah please help me I am in a trouble this is the way we make a dua we ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala Ya Allah you are the only one we have to ask him by his beautiful name by his uh, 
praising his attributes and by asking asking for the sake of wali for the sake of buzurg for the sake of anyone for the sake of even the prophet sallallahu even as the jesus people upon him even at um, daud alayhi salam even even it's adam alayhi salam even it's abraham alayhi salam we cannot make a dua even gibril alayhi salam that's the biggest creation of allah subhanahu wa ta'ala we cannot make a dua for the sake of anyone so asking a dua like that this is a cover and shirk we have to ask from allah because he is the only doer he is the only one there's only one allah who can do that that is up in the arsh and he is the only doer we are not supposed to take the intercession that people usually mistake within asking a dua for the sake of prophet that is something different intercession is something like on the day of judgment and the, uh, and the soul sallallahu will be making an intercession for his ummah and uh, and then allah will filter uh, the people who has done the good deeds according to the Quran and according to the authentic teachings of the Prophet ﷺ, they are the people will be forgiven and they will be removed from the hell and they will put it into the Jannah and they, we are talking about the judgment day we are not talking about the dunya like asking making a dua for the sake of Allah for the sake of the Prophet ﷺ.